nice to see you. I, I recognize you. It's a relief that when we finally meet, she is who she says she is, and even more beautiful than I imagine. Sometimes I feel like I've been waiting my whole life. Here we are, our second life is transposing into real life. I don't know if I'm gonna be interrupted here. <sighs> that was my husband. My name is Asri Falcone. I am a content creator with a second life. I have a housing company and I specialize in high-end and extreme luxury. Asri is not my alter ego. Asri is me. I call Second Life the best and the worst thing that has ever happened to me. It was after going for days straight that the other things just weren't important anymore. My avatar is an 11-year-old girl. One of the fastest growing sites on the internet. Second Life's different than a game because there isn't any goal. Everything in it is created by the people who are there. How cool is that? I think it becomes a problem when you ignore your first life. She feels alive, and it feels like a real life. Things are real because they're there with us and we believe in them. And if they're simulated on a digital computer, it doesn't make any difference to us. I'm usually on my computer 15 to 20 hours a day. That's why it's called the web, because you get stuck in it. The virtual world must contain some sort of danger and risk and possibility of pain or loss to be interesting. In order for me to live my real life, she needs to give up hers.